power of the act of better breathing is learned and becomes more available to the general public, the health of the population will begin to improve and health care costs will begin to go down. This is true. And so this year, uh, last month, I put together a statement to the senators and the legislators because they're trying to figure out what to do with $75 million in surplus money. And I suggested that because only 5% normally goes to prevention for health care, that they consider putting 5% of that $75 million into a preventative program, basically for advocating better breathing practices. So the seeds continue to be planted. And just to share more from the proclamation, better breathing is a natural tranquilizer. And when practiced, balances the central nervous system, allowing the vital organs and the cells to be nourished. Shallow breathing can lead to oxygen deprivation, causing illness, disease, death, and substance abuse that could be prevented. And finally, better breathing is safe, it's cost effective, it's time efficient, you don't need any equipment, and it's always right under our nose. Amazing, isn't, it? isn't that wonderful? The breath of life is always there with it. And and we're not finished yet. This ball is very important. Let me just cool down a little bit here and breathe. Science has proven that we only use about 30% of our ability to bring in air. And this little ball will beautifully demonstrate. This is a normal shallow breather, which most of humanity, we've accumulated um, the disease of shallow breathing, mostly due to stress-related situations. However, what we're teaching you today is the opportunity to expand your ability to bring in more oxygen. Okay? And so we've read through the proclamation. Better breathing practice complements all other disciplines. Anything you're doing for your wellness efforts in your life to, to enjoy quality of life, you add better breathing, bringing more oxygen into your body, and it complements everything you're already doing, which is a wonderful thing. Better breathing practices is a gradual conditioning process. We want to train the body to get comfortable receiving greater amounts of oxygen. Sometimes when you begin to breathe more deeply, you will feel uh, some tingling in the body. That only tells us that we're getting more oxygen and the body's getting used to that. So whenever you feel some tingling as you breathe more, just relax into that. Relax into that. Better breathing is all about relaxing with the breath in whatever you're doing in your life. Whether you're walking to another room, whether you're washing dishes, you're tending to your children, your grandchildren, if you're writing a letter, if you're watching television, if you're working in your office, you always want to maintain a steady rhythm of breathing.